on. This is Mary over here at Images on the Page. I'm going to try vlogging through Sapphicathon. Let's see how it goes. So it started today. I did stay up after midnight to try to get some reading done. I didn't get much done, honestly. Um, I got distracted by my kitty. Molly. You've been bugging me all morning to play with them because I slept in late. Because yesterday was busy. We got new carpeting in. Ow. And so we had to put all our furniture back. That was a process. So I've, I started with Thaw by Elise Springer. And um, I'm liking it so far. I'm only like four pages in. Um, so we'll see how it goes. I have to get ready for work. Which is why you see the silver things in my hair. It's to help the curls not lay flat on my head. Are you itching yourself on your face with this? Well, I will probably check in after work. Bye! So you can't see me at all. But I am currently stuck in the parking lot at work because my door is frozen open. It won't shut. See? So fun. So, hey, at least I can get some reading done. And I'll keep you guys updated. Bye. So, it's been a day. I'm finally home. It's after midnight. I was only supposed to work till like 9.30. And then my car decided to act up. So see, when it gets really cold, my car door freezes. Well, it freezes like the lock mechanism freezes. I'm usually just like letting my car run for a little bit so it heats up, works, so it can unlatch. This time I didn't work. Of course, it's snowing. I had to call my dad to come get me. Then I had to call a tow truck because there's no way I work like... 20 minutes to half an hour, depending on the weather, away from where I live. That's how far away I have to drive. So we're going to call a tow truck, and the tow truck didn't get there until like 11.30. <sighs> so that was fun. That was fun. If this ever happens to your car, the trick is that it locks shut, so it, like there's a hole like this, you just put a screwdriver and force it open, and then it'll lock. I paid a ridiculous amount of money for that trick, but it was better. It was better than getting my car towed. Um, because my phone was dying, I couldn't read on my phone, because that's what I was reading thought on, because I had borrowed it from the library using their Hoopla app. Not sponsored. Um, but because my phone was dying, I couldn't use that, but luckily I had my Kindle with me, so I started Lambs Could Always Become... Lambs Can Always Become Lions... It's actually really good. It's that it's the Robin Hood retelling. I'm really enjoying it so far. It's pretty short, so I'm like 15% of the way through. Um, I might try to finish that one before moving back on to Thaw. We'll see how I'm feeling tomorrow. Well, I have to work again tomorrow. I need to, to kind of play with Wally a bit so that he doesn't tear up all my furniture. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Ta-ta for now. Bye. So I'm shopping at Walmart with my mom. We're looking for clothes for her. I just kind of want to give you an update on Lambs Can Always Become Lions. I'm really liking it so far. I think some of the side characters might be non-binary because they keep doing they, but it, they interchange it with like he, she pronouns as well. So I'm not 100% sure on that. It's really crazy in here. And I will check in later. Hey everyone. It's about the fourth day of the Sapphic Readathon, and I do have to go to work today at three. But I have about an hour to forty-five minutes before I have to head in. I do have to go to the mall to pick up the rest of my cousin's Christmas gift, which will be oh so fun because the mall the weekend right before Christmas it's going to be a disaster. But I don't know if you guys liked actually seeing me read and some of me just talking about what I was reading. So I was going to shoot some of that before I had to head into work. So I guess here we go. 
Really? I need that spot. Come here. Oh my goodness. My cat Wally distracted me. He wanted to play. So I'm really bad at this vlogging thing. I keep forgetting to check in while I'm actually doing the things that I'm doing. So I was just got to work. It's like a minute to three. I don't know how I made it because I ran to the mall first, which was crazy. Bad idea. I left late because Wally was sleeping on my lap and I didn't want to make a move because I'm that kind of cat person. And then I stopped not at one, but two stores in the mall because I had to pick up something for my mom to get my other cousin. They are there in the back. I got my cousin Tivana and she's going to get her, uh, the other cousin uh, Lush. Well, I bought him for her because I was the one who went to the mall because I'm psycho. I still have time somehow to stop at the food court to grab food which was a bad idea because it's going to be super unhealthy, but it almost made me late. But somehow, some way I made it. Yeah, so after work, I actually, I'm 50% of the way through. Lambs can always become lions. I'm really liking it so far. I really like that instead of us, like, seeing, like, they're already in a relationship. Robin, Hood, and Lady Marion are already in a relationship. Their uh, relationship's already established. And that's kind of cool, because then we don't have to worry about, like, see the, like, growing pains of the relationship. I don't know, I just already like that they are already set up that they're not confused about their feelings for each other. Of course, there's things going on in the book. But I have to actually go into work now, and I will check in with you guys later. Bye!